Hello people, uh, I'm making this video now to talk about Obama has this uh, curse upon him. It's the curse of the, I call it the Antichrist curse, the 666, number 666 Antichrist curse. Uh, you know, um, Obama had this very strange event which happened just after his election. You can see it here. Uh, I'm not going to go through the whole article, but th this is an article from Newsweek. You can see here, New Newsweek, see Newsweek staff. And just I'm going to zoom in to this uh, uh, Victoria Jackson, the Saturday Night Live ingenue, fueled the fire when, according to news reports, she wrote on her website that Obama trait bears the traits that resemble the Antichrist. Now, there's this guy called Strandberg, who is, uh, he has a rapture ready which is a Christian website for, he, he tracks signs of the rapture of the apocalypse. So now Strandberg was receiving up to the minute news from his constituents in Illinois. One of the winning lottery numbers of the president elect's home state was 666, which as everyone knows is the sign of the beast, also known as the Antichrist. See here? So anyways, these people, uh, Victoria Jackson and uh, Strandberg, um, they have, they, they have uh, their interpretation of uh, prophecy and things, but one thing is clear that's a fact, it's that 666 was drawn in Obama's state of Illinois right the day after his election. So that's a sign. For, for Christians, that's a sign. And for people who are uh, faith-based, whether they're of whatever religion, that, that's a sign that Obama is marked by 666. So that's like a curse for Obama. Now, um, I think that oh, there are signs now that Obama can fall very fast because uh, there is a very dangerous and fluid situation going on at the Maricopa uh, County. Uh, you know, uh, Joe Arpaio is sheriff of Maricopa County in uh, Arizona. And there's a situation which is very dangerous for Obama over there because uh, Mike Zullo, who is the commander of the Cold Case Posse, said in an interview five days ago that there was a second investigation which had been started, kicked off by Joe Arpaio about Obama. And um, <clears throat> there are some trolls, uh, Obama bots, on the uh, internet who have circulated this uh, rumor that uh, they have been in contact with the Maricopa Sheriff's Office and that the Sheriff's Office has said, no, there is no second investigation. But uh, there, there are conflicting reports. They, they, those people claim that they have been in contact with uh, Joe Arpaio, Arpaio's uh, spokesperson or somebody at the office. I don't know exactly who. They're, they're claiming that it's a guy called uh, Brandon, Lieutenant Brandon Jones, confirmed to her Arizona's politics that the detectives are working on related investigation. Well, anyways, the con th there's a very conflicting situation, and right now we are waiting for the the results. But the very strange thing has happened that the Obots, the, tr the Obama trolls, uh, Mike Zullo in that interview five days ago, he also said that they had tracked trolls to their IP addresses, and the IP addresses went to the Department of Defense. So he claimed it's really earth-shaking that uh, they have they have traced IP addresses to the Department of Defense and they have the numbers and they know who the people are who are working for the Department of Defense and they're trolling on internet and um, in an earlier interview about uh, a month ago uh, Mike Zullo said that they had traced particular people for example the owner of the uh, website called Fogba, Fogba, Fogbo um, they have traced that guy. He said they, they know who the guy is. He is a guy who has uh, psychological problems. He's, he's uh, you know, uh, he's in therapy or whatever. And um, also another guy called Doc Conspiracy. And uh, Doc Conspiracy, I, uh, he, uh, he gave his name here. Uh, Doc Conspiracy is a guy called Kevin Davidson. Kevin Davidson. He, he is a guy that uh, Mike, Mike Zullo has traced he, he, he knows the guy, he knows who he is, and he knows that th this, guy, this guy had uh, created a website or some software to make fake uh, birth certificates. You've you got to believe it. This guy, uh, Kevin Davidson, made software to, to make fake birth certificates. He, he, he created the software, and that's what uh, Mike Zulu claims. 
So that is, it's incredible. And so, you see, it's, it's, a very, it's a very small world. They're, they're just like uh, maybe half a dozen of these guys who are uh, trolling for Obama. Half a dozen of these guys. <laughs> and they're working for the Department of Defense or whatever. I mean, it, it's all interrelated. Um, and because if you look at this article here by Bertha Report, Bertha Report was, was hacked. Was uh, was hacked by uh, by the Obama people. They closed it down for for forty eight hours. And if you look at the uh, comments, you'll see uh, Doc Conspiracy. Doc Conspiracy is uh, commenting here. Here, we're, I'm going to just show you Doc Conspiracy. So th these guys, you see here, they're talking about Fogbo here. You see Fogbo. And uh, here we. we we can find dog conspiracy. He's, he's right here. You know, these guys are all fighting each other. Here, look. This is it. Dog conspiracy. This is the guy. Um, Mike Zulo talked about uh, dog, dog conspiracy. I don't know if dog conspiracy works for the Department of Defense, but this is a guy that uh, Mike Zulo has, has run a background check on this guy. And on Fogbo, too. And dog conspiracy is very active here. He's very active. They're, these guys are really nervous about uh, about the Joe Arpaio investigation. They're very afraid of what's going to uh, what's going to show up. Okay, Doc, Doc Conspiracy, here, here, he's here again. You see, he, he's commenting all the time, on and on and on and on and on. So probably these guys who work for the Department of Defense, or this guy Joe Mannix, or I don't know who who it is, but these guys are really nervous. They're they're hysterical. So. Obama can fall very easily on all of this stuff because uh, this is uh, this is very risky for him because Mike Zullo is on their track. He has uh, he has got their uh, he's got their here. Look here's Doc Conspiracy one more. It's uh, th this guy is just on and on and on and on. He is nervous now. He is nervous now, and these guys are on the warpath, and so. It's very dangerous for Obama because we're waiting for Joe Arpaio's uh, answer right now. And Mike Zullo, Mike Zullo is, is solid. He knows what he's doing. He, he said they tracked these trolls to uh, Department of Defense, their IP addresses, and to DARPA. DARPA is a Department of Defense special disinformation program. So, uh, I mean, this case is done now. And uh, Obama has... Uh, has one criminal investigation uh, going on with him uh, at Maricopa, and they say there's a second one. But I mean, obviously these uh, Obots are going completely berserk. So it's a very fluid and very dangerous situation for Obama. So I, you know, you people go on full alert now because this news is just coming out all the time.